Northwestern at Penn State. That's the next one up. And, you know, Penn State being a 25-point favorite didn't expect it over another Big Ten team. I mean, unless it was Rutgers or whatever. But I just I did not expect that right now. And yet, here we are. Um, you look at the raw numbers, Penn State minus 22.96. I, okay. Uh, I, I've seen Northwestern do this in the past where they just they don't give a rip, right? And this has happened. I mean, this is a trend at this point. Go listen to the boys over at Westlot Pirates. Uh, it is a trend right now where Northwestern is not good in the out-of-conference slate, and every other year they do really, really well against conference opponents. Now, this is not somebody in the same division, and Penn State is really showcasing a lot of talent right now, especially they went down to Auburn, but they beat a, a bad Auburn team. They did beat a pretty good Purdue team on the road. Like this, Penn State looks like they could be all right. How interested is Penn State going to be in this game? Right? They got a big one coming up next week um, or in two weeks or whatever it is. Uh, actually, that is a good question now that I'm thinking about it. You know what? We're going to delay the show for just a second so that I can see. I think Penn State has a bye week next week. And if that is the case, I mean, all bets are off. They, they could end up, I mean, they could. They could steamroll Northwestern here to get ready for the bye week. But let's uh, let's take a look at this. Uh, Penn State. Da, da, da. This is fantastic radio. I know it is. Uh, there we go. Schedule for them. They have got Northwestern. Ah, uh, yes, a bye week, and then at Michigan. I don't think that's going to change how I look at this. You know, yes, it is. Yes, it is. Give me Penn State. Give me Penn State. I'm going to change up my answer here. Penn State to cover the 25. They've got a bye week next week. Northwestern, just the coaching malfeasance that is going on in Evanston. Uh, there are going to be changes made after this year. And if there's not, there needs to be a federal investigation into Evanston, Illinois. I mean, just, just absurd what is happening there. I know they've got injuries on defense. I understand that. But what they are doing with those players, they are not putting them in a good position to be able to win. It is infuriating. And I don't trust them in this spot. So I will take Penn State to cover the 25 there. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app. And make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter, at GaryWCE. And the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show. <laughs>